In this tutorial we're going to show you how to use the custom layout feature and how to add custom classes to the post and body tag with the Genesis framework. So what we want to do is first of all find a post or a page we'd like to edit. I've been using this post hello world as my demo post so I'm just going to keep using that now so I just need to go into the post editor and from here I need to scroll down and just below you find the SEO settings you'll find the layout settings and what you'll first find is the layout of the page you'd like to have so you can choose to which side you would like the sidebar do you want to double sidebars or uh, do you want no sidebar at all so we'll just choose no sidebar at all just to make a nice distinction in what we're going to see now and then from here what you can actually do is use the custom body class and custom post class fields to really really simply add custom CSS classes to either of these so I'm going to go with the custom post class. I'm going to call it WPKB Demo. And though you wouldn't typically do this, at least I'd hope not, is editing the CSS directly in WordPress, which you can do, but probably not a great idea to do it uh, or make a habit of doing it. So I've just added the class to the bottom of our style sheet file here, color of red to the text. So it's nice and obvious. So we'll just update that. That's done and we've got it in there and we'll just hit update and now we just want to view that post as you can see the post has generated itself with the custom layout there's no sidebars anywhere and because of the very very basic CSS that we added and how we added it using the Genesis fields there we've changed the color of this text to red it's not perfect it's probably not something you would do but it, it does definitely help to demonstrate what we're after today so hopefully that clears up how you can use the Genesis custom layouts. And if you have any questions, of course, please feel free to ask in the comments below.